those of you who have undertaken systematic reviews know that it can be incredibly difficult if our question is too broad. Um, I, you know, we, we might be interested in what are effective interventions, the pharmacological interventions for the management of type 2 diabetes. One systematic review can't deal with that. Now, the last time I looked, there were nine different classes of drugs. And within those classes, there were multiple drugs. And there are many, many systematic reviews that do, looking at comparative effectiveness of these different pharmacological interventions. Now we're moving into the realm to bring all of that together into the realm of the umbrella review or the overview that can address a broad scope of issues related to a topic of, of, um, of interest. Um, and it does allow for a nice comparison and contrast of published reviews and an overall examination of a full body of evidence like in that example. There, there are different methodologies for, for umbrella reviews. Some are incredibly, so some are meta-analytical, so they're espousing other statistics. Um, the JBI one is not. It's more about summary of the evidence and providing the user who's interested in a range of interventions or a particular outcome um, the, 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 the good oil, so to speak, in, in a simplified format to bring it all together in tabular presentation of those synthesized findings.